Hi there. I would like to introduce to you one of those very much successful uh, Sudanese writers. Somebody who wrote from the diaspora culture and tried to find a connection between his own homeland and the diasporic experiences. Uh, it is none other than uh, Thaib Sali. Thaib Sali was uh, born in 1929 and uh, he passed away in 2009. Uh, he was born in the village of Deba in uh, northern Sudan. And uh, after the, his education in Sudan and then later in London, he worked at the BBC in London. And then later he worked with the UNESCO and uh, he had been staying in London for a long time. And basically much of his writings happened from there too. Uh, uh, he, his writings which include uh, novels, novellas, short stories, uh, they can all be considered as following a particular cycle which can be titled the Wad Hamid cycle. Now the Wad Hamid cycle is basically um, a cycle of stories which is uh, uh, said with the setting of Wad Hamid, a fictional village placed in northern Sudan. And basically almost all the stories talk about the experience of colonialism and uh, how uh, the tradition uh, tries to meet uh, modernity and the problems and uh, the consequences. So that is basically uh, uh, what Wad Hamid cycle is all about. And I'll just read out a few of the titles uh, penned down by uh, Taib Sali. Uh, in addition to the season of migration to the uh, north, which is a novel under discussion uh, in our uh, coming videos, he has written a novel now. Uh, which is titled or uh, which is in English when, when it was translated uh, into English was titled The Wedding of Zine and then another novel which is titled Bandar Shah uh, it was first published uh, in Arabic in two parts and he has actually written nine stories um, and uh, he began writing a column in the London based Arabic weekly magazine Al Majalla those articles on uh, literary cultural and uh, political uh, topics were all collected under the title Selections and published in nine volumes in Beirut in 2004-2005. So being a prolific writer and reader, um, uh, Sally is actually somebody who could uh, talk about how uh, people construct certain images in, the, in, the, in, the, uh, in a colonial setup, especially when you come to uh, seasons of migration to the north, the novel under discussion in the coming videos. Uh, he depicts uh, the uh, violent history of colonialism and uh, how it shapes the uh, life of contemporary Arabs uh, and African uh, societies in general. So in this particular novel you have uh, a, a, a London educated, a European uh, educated uh, native uh, uh, called uh, Mehmed in confrontation with uh, his double uh, Mustafa Saeed, uh, who actually uh, had, uh, uh, um, who was kind of hypersexual, you know, uh, uh, who, who was uh, somebody who used that exotic appeal in the minds of the of the Europeans uh, regarding uh, Arabia's uh, sexuality, uh, r uh, you know, racist stereotypes, etc., for his own benefit. And uh, he used to manipulate uh, English women and he had this particular tendency to try to associate women with 